Hello everyone. Welcome to our Creativity Can Be Learned webinar. Um, it's lovely to have you here with us this evening. I'm going to start with short introductions of us, um, myself and our panelists. My name is Glynis Fester. I am a small business owner. My company is called Forward Thinking Institute and we do training and coaching. I am a life coach and a career coach, and I design and present training and coaching programs. I am joined today by two lovely ladies, and first I'd like to introduce Vanessa Govender. Vanessa Govender, I've known her for quite a number of years. We shared um, the travel industry in our long-standing careers. And Vanessa has recently started her own business. Her business is called Meraki by V. And she creates unique spaces, gifts, decor, furniture, and curios. Vanessa is a very creative lady. My second panelist is um, Annalise Arthur. Also a long-standing colleague and, and um, from the travel industry. I've known Annalise for many years. And Annalise has also recently started her own business. And her business is called K and A Networks. And what they do is um, they provide solutions and try to assist businesses to generate sales in creative ways. Welcome to our panel this evening, Vanessa and Annalise. Okay, the most prevalent question on all of our minds must be what COVID-19 has done to our businesses and to ourselves. And when I looked at statistics from Scats SA, the unemployment rate, if you don't know it yet, is sitting at 3.1% and it's climbing. I just wanted to share with you just the content of the course that I've created because it absolutely focuses on that environment. So we have to work so, so, so hard at creating the environment and getting it right. So the first thing we cover in the course is how to create an environment that is a DNA. It, it, it has to run throughout everybody in the organization or in the team or in the family, whatever it is that you are doing. The second thing is to um, look at how do we how do we generate the ideas and what do we do with them? How do we how do we pull it all in? How do we know which ones are going to work, which ones are not going to work, which ones we need to put a little bit on the back burner? So that's number two that we look at in the course. And then the third thing is the technique. You know, no golfer has ever been successful without technique. I'm sure you'll agree with me. You can't succeed without technique. And even if you know a little bit about it, knowing a little bit about something is dangerous. You actually have to know a lot about it. So in the course, we do practical scenarios and practical ways of how to do it. And then lastly, we will teach how do you manage it all? Because we aim to make sure that it sticks that when you walk away from the course, you have something tangible and you can already go and implement it. It's that important. So I do believe that it is very important for businesses as well as educators and educational institutes to start looking at creativity 